and smash dice to burn out crash Not Mario Party 6 or Ultra Smash Even Clubhouse games are beat it plus No family feud on SNES Some games they play whether good or bad Have tropes in common my favorite two bats Maybe Rush to play no blood They are PGs, oh thank god Turn face battles in too much text I'd rather be out not having sex Menu clutter and useless stats And random encounters can kiss my ass No game play till hours in Kind regards, masses. It's me, High Bike, and I am back with some more Persona. That last song we were listening to was Metro Madness Act 1 from Sonic before the sequel. But, okay. <laughs> the song that was mixed in with that song was Why Don't You Play Them by Scott the Was. And it's a Siva Gunner rip, of course. Um, this rip just came out yesterday, and... Um, I was listening to it and I was just like, oh my god, this shit fucking slaps. Like, I just love, um, I think this Sonic Before the Sequel game is a fan game. So, like, whenever there's rips of this game, Siva Gunner, like, always, um, they'll always have, like, mashups with, um, whatever tracks are from that fan game. And, like, I, I really like the soundtrack for it because it has a very house feel. And I love me some house. It's just, it's just so good. But yeah. And like the subject material for the, the song is like, oh, like they focus on RPGs and like other games and stuff. So since we're obviously playing an RPG, I decided, you know, it would be it'd be nice to put that before the stream. But anyways, last time on Persona, we got a lot done. Um we uh we're almost maxed out We've almost maxed out um, Yosuke's and Chie's social links. Um, we got the option to romance Chie, but I chose not to because I thought that Yosuke would be an option, but he isn't. Unless, unless I somehow like start the the file and like try to stare at Yosuke and maybe he like changes his mind. I don't know, but I have a sinking feeling that you can't romance Yosuke. But let me try and open that file again. 
Um, what else happened? We found out Ayane was is a vampire, and we also met Rise for the first time. So yeah, a lot happened. But let me just uh. This is the file that's supposed to, like, lead us to Yosuke's next, like, you know, that social link where you're supposed to, like, hug him or whatever, but let's see if he actually shows up. Otherwise, we'll go back and actually progress with the story, because we're supposed to be saving Risei. And Yosuke is not there. It's weird. I don't know why Yosuke doesn't like show up here, even though he did for us like those last two times. But whatever. I just thought I'd give it a shot. All right. But for real, let's get on with the game. Here we are. It's time to find out what happened with Risei. Um, I don't know if Dojima has anything different to say. Yeah. Okay. Never mind. We already discussed what happened with Rise. And that's still the same. Does Nanako say? Yeah, okay. Alright. Well, we'll just uh, move on. Alright, it's time to see her on the Midnight Channel. Let's see how this goes. Another rainy night. Will anything appear on the Midnight Channel? Yes. Yes, it will. You see something on the screen. It's a very vivid image. It appears to be a nightclub of some description. A girl in a swimsuit walks into view of the camera. Oh, hold on. I was just checking if my sound was right. Maru Q, push Rosette, English broke it. Oh. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, okay, I, I thought she was just going to be speaking broken English like the whole time, but okay. Just uh, copying what, what Japanese people usually do with their variety shows, just all speaking in broken English. But anyways. Good evening, good evening! I'm Risei Kujikawa, here to give you all a sexy sex sexual show of sexy sexual sexy sexness. And more sex. <laughs> Sexually! <laughs> Damn, okay. Yeah, they're really sexing it up here. The camera clumsily zooms in on and pans across Risei, showing off her figure. Tonight, I'm going to be pushing the limits of standards and practices. Does everyone know what time it is? Time to get a watch. Ha! Freaking roasted! Oh! <laughs> that was kind of mean. I'm sorry. Please still show me your poops. It's showtime! But show what, you may ask? Well, I'll be showing everything. Ooh, I'm so embarrassed. Is this too hot for TV? Well, they showed someone dying on this show a few months back, so I'm pretty sure nothing is too hot for this fine network. Why the hell am I talking to my TV? That's a good question. Well... If it's worth doing, it's worth doing it all the way. I'm gonna bear it all. No, no, please, let me in. Let me in. I just want to see the boobies. <laughs> Ugh, too late. Oh, well, easy come, easy go, I guess. Hi, Yosuke. Hey, did you see Rise on TV? Yeah. You want a copy? No, thanks. But, is she serious about bearing it all? We've gotta hurry and save her, because I bet her shadow self is gonna do whatever it wants again. Who knows where that TV program could be going? Yosuke, I'm pretty sure you and I have a pretty good idea where that program is going. In a sex sexy sex direction. Yeah, but man, even when we knew who the victim would be, we still couldn't do anything. And that cool detective was no help at all. Uh, anyway, see you tomorrow. You decide to go to bed. Huh? What's this? Where are we? Oh, okay, never mind. It's the TV world.
Teddy, are you all right? Well, I wasn't crying. I was crying a lot. Everyone was having fun out there and you forgot all about me. I've been staring at that one pole for days on end. Oh, we would never do that. We would. <laughs> yeah, we would. Tell him like it is, Yosuke. I was bored. It made me all listless. I'm a useless bear. I don't even know what I am. You're a bear, if that helps. When I'm alone, I think too much, and it just makes me feel even sadder. I was so sad that my chest would burst and cotton would fly out everywhere. Damn, depressed fursuits are pretty frickin' metal. <laughs> Come on, you could go, go over and pet him or something. I don't want to do it. You go do it. Come on, it will cheer him up. If he gets too sad, his chest explodes. Then that fluffy blood will be on your hands. <laughs> <sighs> Let's just both do it. Try scoring with you two someday? No. Oh no. Uh, sure. Anytime you want. Is that even legal? It shouldn't be. I don't know. Last time I checked, there wasn't any rules against romantic involvement with fursuits from TV dimensions. Can we please drop the whole scoring thing? Never! Yeah, they never will. <laughs> uh, anyway, how's it been over here lately? Has a girl called Risei Kujikawa been through here? Can you sense anything? <laughs> hey Jacob, what's up? Risei Kujikawa? Hmm? You can't tell? Your nose is kind of losing its edge lately, huh? Well, it's not like I can smell names! Oh, it's pointless! I'm a worthless bear! Soon I'll have no place at all! And I'll just get thrown away! <laughs> Maybe. That's not true. We wouldn't do that. Right now. Teddy has depression in this game. Confirmed. Really? So I can stay with you all? Maybe. Okay, so do you need us to go out and pretend to find some clues that'll help you search like last time? They're gonna skip it. I don't think pretend investigations will help this time. I'll need a real hint about this Rise. Oh no, we actually have to investigate? So we'll really have to go out and do all that bumbling around filler trash? Well, yeah. Unless any of you know anything about her off the top of your head. Well, okay, allow the number one fans to um, bestow some information. Oh, oh, I know! <clears throat> <laughs> oh, there we go, Yosuke. Her favorite food is Inari Tofu. She has six out- uh, she's toured into six different countries. Her family residents- oh my god. Her favorite color is lavender. She was- okay, jeez! Calm down, Yosuke! That's enough! I think I got something! <laughs> I love how they just, like, completely, like, um... You know, they, they just skip over the whole investigation stuff. Just because, um, Yosuke's, like, a super fan. <laughs> yeah. He's a simp! <laughs> That's what a real fan looks like, Kanji. Yeah, yeah, shut up. <laughs> okay, I think I got something! There's something that way! I think I found her! Wow, Teddy, that's really good! You can smell better just because some crazed fanboy yelled a bunch of trivia at you? Come on, take us there! Alright! Follow me! What is this place? It's all dark. No idea. But I bet it has no sexual undertones or overtones whatsoever. Mm-hmm. Oh, hey, Choke, what's up? You're out shopping at the mall. Ooh, getting some... Getting some goods, huh? Well, I hope you're having fun. But hey. <laughs> I like how there's a fucking sign that just straight out says sexual. 
Okay, just pretend the last thing I said was sarcastic. Whoa, is this a... Oh, like the kind... Uh-huh. So, this is a strip joint. All this time, all I needed to do to get into one was jump into the TV. Shit. <laughs> strip? Oh, oh, I know what that is! It's the thing zebras have! Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, sure, Teddy. Jeez, it's so bright in here. It's hurting my eyes even with these glasses on. Uh, yeah. Do we have to go in? You guys would enjoy a place like this. We wouldn't want to ruin that. Hey, you made me and Yosuke enter a gay bathhouse, so by default, you are obliged to enter a strip club with us. You're buying a sweatshirt for yourself with your mom that you'll be wearing at a Christmas party. Ooh, are you doing ugly Christmas sweaters? Yeah, it's not like you're in danger of being sexually assaulted by anyone you aren't normally in danger of being sexually assaulted by. Jeez, okay. Oh yeah, good question, Chuck. When are you gonna wear the Chie Booty Upskirt shirt? Or like, when are you gonna buy it? If you haven't already. If anything goes wrong, you can blame... Uh... Teddy! What?! He's our navigator in the TV world, so if you end up in some bad situation, it would be his fault for navigating you into someone's cleavage. <laughs> Ugh, fine. Let's go on. Okay, I do want to try Kanji out. We need Yukiko for healing. Um... Oh, but I want to try Chie stuff too! Shit! You're trying to look for an ugly Christmas sweater? Nice. Yeah, see, I'm getting nervous now, um, cause like, my, uh, Naruto and Sasuke Christmas sweater have not come in yet. Um, on the bright side, um, I'm actually not going to have a party on Friday, cause like, um, our team leader, like, she has a volleyball tournament to go to, like, the next day, so that- I'm guessing that's why. Or maybe it was later that day, I don't- I don't remember. But we're basically having an extended lunch that day anyways, and then the Christmas sweater thing is going to be moved to uh, Monday. So hopefully, like, the, the sweatshirt comes in by that time, otherwise I'm going to have to, like, go out and buy. But that also means that we might actually have movie night on Friday then. Like, continue watching ghost stories. Yeah, at least, like, a f like maybe, like, fewer episodes, but at least it'll be something. I'll let y'all know. Oh, you're gonna buy it soon? Maybe tomorrow? <laughs> you better show it when you get it. Uh, but yeah, let's- let's save. Let me talk to everyone first. Um, I can't think of any striptease puns. So, um... What? Persona! That was a cat pun! Okay. Boo. I swear, the second I see boob, I'm leaving. Pfft, stop being so uptight. I will leave you in the homo sauna. <laughs> okay, jeez, jeez, I'll be good. We're all responsible for Chucky's corruption. Oh yeah, absolutely. I, I, I take full responsibility. <laughs> yeah. Saving Kanji got pretty weird, but I think this one is going to be a lot worse. Wait, can I switch out party members anytime in the dungeon? Cause like, you're not having the option to like, just leave everyone- anyone behind. Interesting. Shouldn't these places normally have poles? What a letdown. Damn, Kanji- Kanji was really looking forward to like, going to a strip club. So, a strip tease is when... Yeah, this can't be good. Hey, don't look at me like that! I don't exclusively have to speak in fuck yous when talking to you. Imagine if Yosuke just kept going, Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Okay, let's go in the dungeon. So, how does this- Oh, you know what? I think maybe I can like switch them out. Or not? I don't- How do you- How am I gonna get Kanji in the party? Maybe he'll come in when someone dies? I don't know how this works. Oh! Let me, let me, like, change clothes. I want Yosuke to wear his- or hold on. I think it's in key items. 
Inkling to English. Oh, right, hold on. I forgot we can read this, I think. Hold on. Like the, the man horror strawberry thing for, for Yosuke. But let's see. A book given to you by Yosuke should teach you how to understand Cockney. Now is not the time for reading. Oh, I guess we'll have to check it out later. <laughs> um, Yosuke Nightcore All-Star. Get your waifu on. Yeah. Look at him in his school uniform. His schoolgirl uniform. Mm. Alright. Word has it that Kanji stitched that jacket onto the back of that shirt so it wouldn't fall off. That would make sense, because, like, it is hard to keep your, like, jacket on your shoulders like that. Because, like, I do it sometimes and, like, um... I'd have to keep adjusting it, so that would make sense. <laughs> yes, I am giddy over Yosuke's Nightcore All-Star outfit. Um, let's see. Wait! Oh no, I I've read that. Let's see. Kanji's regular weekend clothes. Nothing like trying to fight shadows in a leather jacket. Display your eye sockets proudly. I actually do want to do that. Wait, so... Yeah, so Kanji's not there. I don't know how we, like, switch. Are those supposed to be Rise body pillows or just a poster? Hmm. Okay, um... Let's see. Uh, I'll give you to the casual clothes. Where's Chie's casual clothes? There they are. And can I read... I'm pretty sure it's gonna be like, now's not the time for reading, but I want to look. An original story by useless Narukami detailing the exploits of Yosuke, the six million dollar man whore. Yeah, I guess I'll have to check that when we're out of the TV world. But okay. Where are the shadows? There's the shadows. Okay, but where are the stairs? There's the stairs, that was fast. Man, those shadows weren't even trying to get up to us. They can't catch us. Aw, I kind of want to interact with the pole. Yeah, there's the stairs already. Okay, we have to go this way. Or not. Okay, maybe it like loops around or something. But yeah, how has your guys' day been? Mine was nice. Oh, my coworkers are really sweet. So if you didn't see in the server and on Instagram, um, they like they decorated my cubicle with a bunch of um graduation like um uh ornaments and balloons and stuff. It was very nice. But yeah, I I took care of a shit a shit ton of documents like being uploaded and everything. And I finally finished the task, so we're Gucci. Um... Okay, so that's Revive. Let's see. Mazio. Oh, never mind. Um... Hmm, not yet. We can't use that yet. Um... That's... That's gonna be a last resort. Um... Uh, let's do, uh... Magaru... Excuse me. Mabufu... Just test the waters, see who's weak to what. Oh, I didn't notice there were- those were razors back there! I thought we were just fighting the Tabasco. So the razors are weak to lightning. Oh, hot sauce absorbs ice. Shit. Okay. Wait! Oh, Yukiko's knocked down. Alright. Well, you're gonna keep doing Mazio. Oh, cold sauce, right. Yeah, they're cold. Because they're absorbing the ice, right. Okay, so Chie, you're just gonna uh, hit, I don't know, the cold sauce. Oh, okay. Nice crit. Haha. Oh no, Chie is pissed. Uh oh. Okay. Don't don't I have like Dia or something? Diorama. Okay. Yeah, do that on yourself. You went to Oh that's right, you went to your doctor's appointment today. 
Then it led to you going to the mall. That's all so far. Okay, nice, nice. How'd your checkup go? Hey, Chucky, how was your prostate exam? <laughs> Damn, imagine. Oh, wait, uh... Oh, I didn't get to heal myself. Um, you know... Let's use medicine. Oh. Okay, I'll take that, that's fine. Look, we got a lot of medicines, I'm... I'm good. What? When do they... <laughs> when do they start mixing Space Jam with this song? Okay, well... Mazio... You're gonna hit, you're gonna hit, you're gonna hit. <gasps> they're immune to phys- oh, they're immune to physicals! Come on and slam! Damn, okay, so we can't do physicals at all then. Alright. Magic only. Okay, so just no ice, so Chie is just gonna hit the cold sauce. Alright, Mazio, Magaru, hit the sauce, Maraki. But yeah, I don't know how I can switch Kanji into battle. Damn, they always knock Yukiko down! What's up with that? Okay. Um, here, Mazio. Attack. Attack. Probably because Yugi goes weak to ice. Oh, wait, yeah. Oh, right. She's just slower than them. Yeah. Uh oh. Damn, that thing barely has any HP left. Alright. Just Zio, and then everyone else guard. Or actually, Yosuke? Since you're here, why don't you do a Dia Rama on yourself and then blah blah. Yay, a level up. Supersonic, what's that? I need to be myself. Briefly raises. Oh, okay. Alright. Oh, look at all those chests! Oh, it's just for display. Boo. Boo! Oh! Oh, it was- <laughs> I didn't have to use Diorama then, but at least the SP is restored, so I can't complain. Alright, well that was cool. Um... Stop to watch, okay. Let's see. Mazio, Magaru. Try Bufu on that stop to watch, and then Maragi. Okay, so the watch is weak to win then. Oh, finally Yuki Kogan land hits. There we go. Alright. Attack. This isn't what you thought that I meant when we s you said- <laughs> Oh, this isn't what I thought you meant when you said we were gonna go to the strip club to see a lot of big chests. <laughs> yeah, really. Nice! Okay, cool. Cool, cool. Ooh, look at those level ups. Oh, flame pin, doesn't that, um, hold on. Oh. I think it'd be better for Yukiko to keep that ice pin. Wait, is Chi is weak to fire, right? Oh, okay, never mind. She has a fire pin already. Alright. 
this place is huge. I like saw the stairs over there. How do we get there? Well, at least we're getting more chests. I'm just surprised there aren't really random encounters here and it's just the shadows running into us. Because usually there's, um... Usually there's random encounters too. But okay. The prostate exam was okay? Good. <laughs> Nice, Yosuke! Damn! There we go, teamwork! Yeah, and another level up. Look at that. Um, no, that was a dead end. Let's see, where have I not gone? That was a dead end, too. Okay. Mazio, Magaru, uh, hit the cold sauce, Maragi. <laughs> oh, there goes Yukiko again. Where goes that dang Yukiko again? Well, that girl ain't right, I tell you what! <laughs> Alright, um... Let's see, I do need to focus Mazio. Yosuke, do Diorama. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, shit! Everyone's incapacitated! Fuck! Alright, okay, at least useless is good now. Mazio. <gasps> oh, Jesus! Oh, Jesus! You! Yeah, you know what? You do Diorama on yourself, and Chie will just kick. Oh, okay, thanks, Yosuke. <laughs> Let's see, maybe I should use an item. How many life stones do I have? Yeah, I should use that. Okay, I think it'll be okay. Oh wait, actually I'll use a peach seed too. Like, I never really use those. There we go, that's good. Hmm... I think we've gone here- never enough. Okay, well, we haven't been here yet. Ah, the cold sauce. All right. Uh, wait. I want you to do Magaru. You hit. Actually, I want you to do Rampage, maybe. Yeah, let's do Rampage, and then you're going to Maragi. Excuse me. You know what? I'm gonna switch Yukiko out. If, let me see if I can figure out how to do that. Alright, um... But after battle, because I don't think I can do that here. So then you're gonna do Rampage again. There we go. Let's see, how am I gonna do that? How do I switch kanji in? I want to use kanji, damn it. Oh, formation, but... That's weird! Oh! I think, okay, I think I have to do the formation manually from the menu outside of the dungeon, so that's why. I'm just so used to, like, talking to party members to switch them out. Okay, well that explains things. Alright. Masio, Magaru, Mabufu, Maragi. At least no one can knock down Yukiko this time. T. 
Teamwork. Yeah, and another level up. Look at that. Okay, we gotta go home. Cool. Where are those stairs? Damn it. Oh wait, maybe it's here. There it is. Haha. <laughs> Okay, let's go this way. Where did all the chests go? Wait, what's that? Is that a door? Ah, oh, it's just decoration. You thought I was trying to go back down to swap kanji in? No! I don't want to get out of the dungeon. I'm fine. Like, I think what- I think the deal is you're only, like, allowed to, um, switch the- switch the formation while you're, like, outside of the dungeon. So, it's okay. Uh, hmm. Let's do, uh, let's do Fetal End. Did Chie have a new ability I wanted to use? Um, skills, sure. Er, hold on, let me check again. Yeah, like the Feet of Fury. I think... Yeah, like there's that, but I'd rather use those for like... Um... What is it? For like, a boss battle or mid-boss battle? Wait, 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 hold on. I want you to do... Oh, never mind, that was the right one. And then Meragi. Gurarakarm? Um... Oh, what did that do again? It's... It, um, I think it revives your ally, like, with 60% HP. I'll look at the description again, but it, it's... It's something they made up for this game. Which is pretty cool. Like... It's pretty OP, too. Like, I like that... Like, it's really useful. Like, useless is not... Useless with that skill. Oh shit, Chie is like almost dead. Damn, Yukiko can't do anything. Alright, I have to focus on healing Chie. And you're going to do. <sighs> Let's. Let's see. Healing boot kicks held out of the enemy. Oh! Um, okay! I'm gonna do healing boot then. Try that on cold sauce. Give Chie some more health. Oh wait, Chie's pissed! Never mind! Damn it! I wanted to use that healing boot. Fuck. Come on, Yukiko, snap out of it. Oh no. Oh no. Alright, um. Mm. You're gonna use Diorama. Yosuke is gonna do Magaru because uh, we need to get that watch out of the way. At least have one person attack. There we go. Oh, Chie! Oh, jeez. Oh my god. Okay. Damn it, Yukiko's still fucking confused. But yeah, the Gararikarm revive. Yeah, 65% of their HP. And it always moves first in battle, so that's- that's really good. Like, whoever made this game thought- they thought of, like, something that would be really useful. Okay, sorry, Yukiko, but you might have to- Actually? No. Yosuke... No, you know what? Yukiko's not doing anything. She's just a sitting duck. Yosuke, heal yourself. You both heal yourselves. Yeah, because Chie can do that. Sorry, Yukiko. Oh, jeez. Alright, Mazio. Nice, Yosuke! Yeah, nice, Chie! There we go. Oh! Oh, okay! It's cool that Kanji can get experience from this, too! Okay, that's good. Okay, so we need to heal you- get Yukiko back alive. Unless... Can I try out Garavikarm right now? 
No. Okay, I guess that's only in battle. Oh, wait, no, I just don't have enough MP. Wait, I just realized the bar says SP, but then, like, the costs for the moves say MP. <laughs> they even get it mixed it up. Or, even get it mixed up. Um, I kind of... You know what? Didn't we just get to this floor? I think we should, like, go back. Oh no, the Reaper. Well, or er, no, you know what? It's fine. How many revival beads do I have? Or, like, whatever the revival things were. Wait, if I even have any. Hold on. Okay, well, um... Hmm. I don't know if I want to use my snuff souls or whatever. Like, we did just get here, didn't we? At least there's no random encounters. Wait, guys! I said something really wrong with this chest! Leave it alone. Resay! Oh, hold on. What's this? What is this? What is this? Wait. Uh, hold on. Let me, uh, let me switch my overlays real quick. For a twink, he's awfully sure of so Wait. Let's see, where's your fucking rage? Where's your anger? <laughs> Wait, is he- Is he saying rise or rise? <laughs> what is this? Like, if- I'm not sure if it's supposed to be persona related or not. So now I'm not sure if it's rise or rise. Oh. Haha, <laughs> very funny. Okay, um- uh, I don't know. I don't know. Like, I don't think this would be enough anyways if I wanted to bring her back. You know what? I think we should go home. And then we'll come back. Oh! No! Oh, that was a close one. Yeah, let, let's go home. Sensei, I've noticed that there is something hanging around that weird steamy place. It's not related to the case, but you might want to check it out. Ooh, I wonder what's going to be there. The new dungeon. Uh, hey, I've been wondering. You were kidnapped too, right, Yukiko? Uh, yeah. It wasn't too long before you. So, like, you came out to everyone too, right? That's, um... What was it? Er, the hell was that for? My jaw. Uh, oh, sorry. I didn't mean to hit you so hard. I'll be more gentle next time. <laughs> Damn, Rip. Hit more. Oh, wait. Oh, never mind. I remember this dialogue now. Oh, shit. Were you watching the whole time? <laughs> no, we're, we're good. You know what? I want to explore that bathhouse um, dungeon or whatever next. I wonder, will Yosuke come? <gasps> <laughs> True kawaii! <laughs> oh my god, he just doesn't say anything. Does Chie say anything different? No? Okay. <laughs> and then, yeah, okay. Alright. Oh wait, let me save real quick. Yosuke is forever true kawaii. Alright, yeah, let's go home and rest up. We'll check out whatever's in Kanji's um, bat bathhouse later, the next time we go to the TV world. But yeah, we have plenty of time. Okay, just wanted to check. Oh hey, it's my birthday! Hmm. 
Do I wear too much green? Chie. Chie. Oh, I wanted to hang out with Yosuke on my birthday. Oh well. You know what? It'd be good to finish Chie's social link off. Yeah, let's let's do it. The Yasugami's interior basketball court. No teams seem to be using it today, so you were able to use it for yourselves. Sheesh! After all of that training, you still can't get it in the hoop? Maybe you just aren't meant to play this sport. Damn, Rip! I have very selective sporting ability. I bet I could kick your ass at 10-pin bowling with little bumper things up, but still... <laughs> damn. Still as adorably stupid as ever. Uh, hey, uh, useless? There's something I need to say. Something only you should really hear. It's too late to go back on denying my sex request. <laughs> no, it's not that. Ugh, I had just gotten it out of my brain and you go and bring it back up. Nani? It's just that... I'm honestly still not sure what my good points are. Chie, you have a ton of good points. You slam and jam. You are strong. But I figured I'll just keep on searching. The power I've gotten. The fabled purse owner, as Yosuke's been calling it. Oh, he calls it that too. It's what I've been wanting all along. The power to protect everyone. Yukiko, my friends, my family, this town. Well, good luck with that, considering I'm pretty sure you can't call upon your persona outside of the demon world. Trust me, I tried to once, when there was a dog across the street that wouldn't shut up when I was trying to sleep. Ah, uh, well, anyway, in some weird way, I feel like you've helped me realize all this. I only started hanging around with you so I'd have someone adorably dumb to enjoy. Man, she's really calling us adorable out here. So, uh, as a little token of us being friends... Chie dumps a handful of different wristbands into your hands. Oh, she's got the silly bands! <laughs> they make a matching pair with mine. <laughs> oh, and they're new, so they're clean. Wow. I will never use these. Damn rude! But yes, Chie slams and jams and she is strong. Those are good points. Those are very good points. You feel your relationship with Chie is as strong as it could ever be. Yay! We maxed out her social link! You have forged a strong bond with Chie, one that can never be broken. Except it maybe can be. Uh-oh. I don't like the sound of that. Your bond with Chie has affected her persona. Resist fire was added to Chie's persona skills! Oh hell yeah! Let's go! Very nice. Hey, uh, I'm feeling a little sick. Oh, that's right! It's time to evolve! Chie's strong will that allowed her to accept and overcome her weaknesses has awakened her heart's true power. <laughs> What's it gonna be? <laughs> oh, okay. Wait! It's Charles Barkley now! Yes! <laughs> Darth Barkley! Chie's persona has been reborn! Tomoe has <laughs> Tomoe <laughs> Tomoe has transfigured into Suzuka Barkley! <laughs> Damn, the ultimate slam jammer! Oh my god! <laughs> I I'm back! <gasps> huh? What happened to you? Wait, was she actually in space? I, I went to space for like six seconds. I couldn't breathe. Damn, okay. <laughs> I like that they addressed that. No, it was a different Space Jam guy. Um, yeah, like, it, it was- I, I forget his name! The other guy in Space Jam! I just can't remember it. Oh, hey, Wolf, what's up? You just walked in on Chie's, um, Tomoe evolving into Suzuka Barkley. The best persona. No, you didn't miss B-Ball Boy. We- You know what's funny? We haven't done a single Social Link event with him yet. Hopefully we can change that this stream. After a few more failed hoops with Chie, you said your goodbyes and went home. What you did miss was us finally getting into the the stripper dungeon. 
Okay, we definitely want to save there. Ooh, that was good. Oh wait, wrong button. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're not really gonna use Yukiko's um media, so let's um uh, change. Yukiko, you're gonna switch out with Kanji. There we go. Okay. Yeah, damn. Damn indeed. Read books. Okay, final. I wanted to write fan fiction. Like, hanging out with Chie wanted me to, like, kind of gave me the urge to, like, write fan fiction, but fine. It is important to study. He had a busy day. A busy. A busy couple of weeks, actually. Oh, damn, what happened? Oh, you meant the inventory books! Oh, okay. Alright, we can still look at it, though. I don't think there should be an event. Here. Like, as long as we're not in the dungeon, I think we can read them. Otherwise, we'll do it again in the evening. We'll see. We'll see. Ah, <sighs> still no sign of Yosuke. Alright, so let's take a look at um, these books. You begin reading the book. So there's England- English to England? England to English, right. Pee pee! <laughs> What's up, Hector? Useful English slang words. Bird equals woman. <laughs> Bloke equals man. Git equals unpleasant or contemptible person. Pillock, a stupid person. I've only heard pillow ever being used like once or twice. Like, I rarely hear that. Oh, let's see. Today you had to finish a test because you missed the last two days due to hospital and your crew for an event. Oh, what happened? Are you good? Sod equals an unpleasant person, an arsehole, if you will. Can also be used in the context of saying sold off as a more polite way of saying fuck off. Bollocks equals means testicles, though it can be described something that's generally not good. E.g. That's a load of bollocks. He's talking bollocks, etc. Today you had to decide which story you're going to submit to a contest, so you gotta send that tomorrow. Ooh, sounds fun. Good luck with that. Tab equals cigarette. Knob technically means penis, though it can be used in the context of an insult. E.g. What you looking at, knobhead? Bladdered equals drunk. Pronunciations with a cockney accent. At, out, you, you, to, 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 af, half, of, of, da, da, the, n, and, think, 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 one, want, er, here, inner, into, yar, yer, your, 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 already, already, b, Bit, other, or other, other, huma, humor, don't forget wa'a, <laughs> the water, <laughs> ed, head, our, or, our, our. You auditioned for the local production of Fame, ooh. The director asked why she hasn't seen you before and liked your monologue, so she wants you in a poetry out loud contest next month. Oh, that's awesome, dude, congrats. Yeah, like, good luck. I hope you get the role you want, but yeah. Oh, useless is learning British because, like, um, Naoto speaks in a Cockney accent, so we have this dictionary so we can understand her better. <laughs> but yeah. Oh, you're fine. You were just getting a throat checkup. Oh, okay. Okay. Good, good. Glad to hear you're good. <laughs> you think you've learned enough. I wonder- I'll look at it again later, see if there's any more, otherwise we'll skip through. But anyways, the most important book, <clears throat> excuse me, it's time for Yosuke, the six million dollar man whore. My kind of story. Let's see, you bought a game called Carry On and it's a Metroidvania style game, except you play as the monster taking out scientists and security and stuff. You know, I think I've heard about that game, but that's, that's an interesting concept. Yeah. It sounds cool. Hope you're having fun with that. It'd be funny if you could open up the book whenever Naoto talks. I know, really. <laughs> Maybe, or who knows? Maybe next time. We'll see. But anyways, here's the book. <clears throat> Yosuke XF Man Whore Double Strawberry. Chapter 1. 
I don't have any good Chie related porn puns, but the other chapters have funny titles, so keep reading, please. Oh god. What? It's complete with music! Essentially, Yosuke Hanamura fell back through the TV he had so carelessly jumped through in search of the truth. As he gracefully fell onto his graceful ass, he realized his ass was in fact not landing on the cold, unforgiving slates of Juness, but rather something something, warm and succulent. The surface. It was Chie's super hot godly thighs. <laughs> Yosuke shrieked, realizing where he was sat, which was quickly countered by Chie's own. Eh Both of them immediately got super duper intense nosebleeds. Oh fuck it. It's going too fast! It's going too fast! Stop! Stop! I can't read out loud! Alright, guys, just read it on your own. Unless I could go back. Oh my god. <laughs> um, yeah, so for context, this is um a fan fiction that um useless has been writing. Um, you know, every time we write the the fan fi oh. God, I wish that were me. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> Yosuke shouted. <laughs> I can't. Come coil. Oh my god. With his sexual madness still as active as ever. Damn. This is just sounding like my AI dungeons. A fan what? I mean, what? <laughs> over and over. Holy shit. Damn. Feel that mighty wind. Feel that mighty wind indeed. Holy shit. Oh god, this is getting me wet. Wow. God, I wish that were- Oh, <laughs> the fucking Yosuke sounds. The Chie sounds too. Oh my god. Super sick. Oh. What happened? They noticed a 30 or so year old woman had slipped over in Yosuke and Chie's ever-growing sweat puddle of sexual madness. Wait. You're in the middle of a shopping aisle? Uh-oh, Juna's getting the lawsuit. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna go back to the VOD and, like, read over what what was happening. Wow. You heard that? Damn. Wow, Chie's godly super hot thighs. Yeah, Chuck wishes that were him, and then I wish I was getting pounded by Yosuke over and 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 over. Is there actual sound? What do you mean? What, what do you- <laughs> I mean, we don't hear them grunting if that's what you're getting at. <laughs> uh, I am such a good writer. Oh, you want to hear the pounding? Well, we can make the sound if you want. I can make the sounds if you want. <laughs> no. God, I can't believe they had the fucking Star Wars moving text. Well, that was that. We'll check out chapter 2 next time, I guess. Or, I'm hoping we can read chapter 2. Oh, Ayane time. Here. Isn't there a second book in my inventory? That was the second book. We'll look again, just in case. Alright, everyone. Today's the day we'll be performing down at the hospital. Hope your trombone is set to maximum annoyance, Ayane. Yup. I've been practicing really hard. I've gotten really good at all my parts. A second fanfic thing? Um, no. That was the only one. I mean, there could be another chapter, like, included, but... Yeah, we'll look at that later. Scroll up if you want to hear you flexing towards an audience. Oh yeah, I'm sorry. That, that was a longer comment. I was just too baffled by <laughs> the fanfic. Let's see. The concert was tonight. During the bit where you moved the instruments and amps out of the way, a friend you were- A friend was in the audience, shared your name because you were somehow in charge of the crew. Before you went backstage, you flexed your arm and people clapped? Damn! <laughs> this sounds like- <laughs> That sounds like something off a sitcom! I love that! That's great! I'm glad you got to flex for the audience. Speaking of trombone, the, di the director wanted to know if you could play a trombone solo in the show, if the opportunity arises. Oh, right, I forgot, you're a tromboner. Ooh, okay. Well, you're definitely gonna do better than Ayane, that's for sure. <laughs> Just between you and me, Useless, I think I've been able to focus way better now that I've got a consistent source of really nice blood. 
Uh, so, thanks. You're a complete idiot, but with a heart of gold. Or <laughs> copper at least, yeah. No, no, probably just a heart of sandstone actually. But that's still alright. Today was just a lot. I can tell, yeah, that you have been through a lot, my, my friend. But yeah. Right now you're here to relax. And yeah, like, it was all a day's worth. But yeah. Definitely worth. Though, maybe you should spray paint it black. It'll look cooler. You thought Yosuke Nightcore All-Star was a fanfic chapter, but it's just his schoolgirl outfit. Yeah, it's the schoolgirl outfit. Yeah, okay. The event on Saturday was cancelled so you can finally relax? Ooh, okay! Nice, nice. Yeah, like that's too bad, but hey, at least you have more relaxation time. All in a day's work, absolutely. And with all the blood being taken out of me, I've only been feeling slightly unconscious. Maybe if I started injecting myself with- Oh, he's back. Oh, hey, it's Shiro, my favorite guy. You healed quicker than I intended- thought! Yes, it still kind of hurts, but I should be able to play today, sir. Damn, I'm surprised he's still coming back after um he, uh quote-unquote, fell off his bike. I don't know, I'd be kind of intimidated to come back. <laughs> I don't know about that. Did you break- your coffee is right here, sir. Damn. Welcome back to the team, sport! Now let's get performing down at that hospital. Hey, but... Never mind. Hey, Shiro, you hear something? No, sir. Okay, good. Damn, Rip. The fires of hatred have returned and are burning brighter and stronger than ever. That was the first real chance I've had to realize my dream. And it just slips away from me like nothing. Aw. I've always wanted to see my music reach out to someone. Someone who needs it. If I played at the hospital, then I could have... Why couldn't I just speak up? Maybe you should just get involved in a less trombone-oriented society. Quiet, trumpet fucker! <laughs> I feel like... Oh god. I, I feel like I can't just keep the flames of hatred within me any longer. The only person who I'm ever able to say anything remotely negative to is you. And I'm tired of it! I feel like I'm going to have to change. I don't want to let these flames of pure hatred continue to burn. I want to start sticking up for myself. Treating everyone more like I treat you. Hmm. It seems you're inspiring Ayane for the wrong reasons once again. I know trumpet fucker that- <laughs> That is too good. All trumpetists are trumpet fuckers now. But hey, social link 7. <sighs> I'm just gonna go home for today. You said your goodbyes to Ayane before heading home. Yeah, we definitely want to save. Poor Ayane. Will she ever release the flames of hatred? Who knows? Yeah, write more fanfiction. I want some more Yosuke man whore strawberry. Yosuke, finally! <laughs> Finally, we can max out your social link! I got some problems I need to vent useless. You know what to do. Alright, let's go, Yosuke. As someone who hates the trumpets, you're using that? Good, I'm glad. Trumpet fuckers should be in everyone's vocab, TBH. Samegawa Riverbank. Yosuke has taken you here again. I hated this town when I first came here. It's so small. But thinking about it now, it's a nice town. With nice people. Well, besides the one guy going around killing people. But still, nice town when you're not hanging upside down from an antenna. It doesn't matter where you are. 
The things important to you can never be far off. Gah, what am I saying? I'm talking like somebody's grandma. You know, I've thought on this for a while. And there's something I need to tell you. Is he gonna confess to us? <laughs> Ever since you got your persona, I've been jealous of you in some way. I thought you would have been like me. Some ass who comes in from the city and is immediately bored by everything. But despite where you come from, and how completely, absolutely insufferable and unqualified you are, everyone seems to tolerate your stupid shit to no end. Everyone automatically just seems to keep wanting to be around you despite the horrible things you do and say. They even acknowledge how terrible you are and still, they continue to ask you to hang out and stuff. Um, that includes you too, Yosuke. <laughs> yeah, see? Even me. Despite how at least 90% of what I say would make it seem like I never want to be around you ever. Which, I really don't, by the way. Oh? Nah. You love me and you know it. Everyone does. Thank you. Thank you. Everyone does. You're starting to make me regret having a remotely serious talk with you. <laughs> you shouldn't be scared to talk to me, Yosuke. A good husband will always listen. This is the reason I'm the one who convinces everyone to give up and go home if you happen to get knocked out in the TV world. Aw, Yosuke! Now, let me finish my speech. You're our leader. You're the one with all the TV tickling powers. You is just me if I was a guy. Exactly. <laughs> exactly! But <laughs> Yosuke needs to love me though. And I'm just the jack-off who stands in the back wishing he was more important. Jacking off what? Yes, yeah, useless. This whole time I've been forcing your dumb ass to listen to all my problems when it's quite clear you're st too stupid to care. All while I was jealous of the unrealistic amount of accolades you get for no adequate reason. So, because of all that, I want you to punch me. What? You heard me! Punch me! You need to knock all this crap out of me! But but I don't want to. You have to! Hit me! I don't wanna! You have to! D do it! I don't- Do it! I just- Just hit me! I deserve it! No, please! <laughs> <gasps> oh my god, they actually used a Yosuke grunt. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, hello? <laughs> yeah, play more Yosuke Grunts, please. Did I do it right? Damn it, you weren't actually meant to do it. Then why'd you keep pressing us? But, but you said... Screw what I said. Whenever anyone tells you to punch them, you're supposed to decline. <laughs> yeah, there we go. There's our Yosuke scream. Damn, we gave him a bitch slap. <sighs> you know, I guess if we're gonna be equal, we have to fight it out. Equally. Oh. Okay. Alright. It's time to settle this shit once and for all. Let's get equal through fighting equally. Hey, useless. Look over there. I think it's a black person in the anime. Oh no. You couldn't hear the Yosuke grunts? Oh, well, uh, he did it right up close and personal in my ears, so, you know. Yeah, no, I, I know what you mean. Of course you can hear the Yosuke scream. I mean, as long as I can hear it. What? Where? I need to get a photo! <laughs> Damn, Yosuke, alright! Oh, Jesus. You one-sidedly brawled it out with Yosuke. Wait, I <laughs> And he still ends up being the one on the ground? Well, uh, that went against all expectations. That's why you asked if there was sound earlier. Oh! That was way back, though. No, like, there weren't any grunts during the fanfic. There was- Yosuke was just grunting after, a uh, After we hit him here. Dude, 
Your hits are freaking brutal. I'm pretty brutal in bed too. Wink, wink. But <laughs> thanks. Physically attacking you sure beats attacking you with words. You know, I'm ashamed to say this, but I guess we could be kind of sort of almost acquaintances because I still mostly hate you. You aren't a terrible person. Just really, 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 really unbelievably stupid. From here out, I'm going to live without lying to myself. For my sake. For Saki. Her ghost doesn't care. Some of us prefer illusion to despair. Damn. Eh, you know, I think you've actually helped me. I guess I just needed something to talk at. Next time, I'll remember that a brick wall would probably be a better choice. Damn. You feel your relationship with Yosuke is as strong as it could ever be. You're finally kind of sort of almost acquaintances because he still mostly hates you. <laughs> that hurts. But yay! The Yosuke Hanamura brochure link has grown to level 10! You have forged a strong bond with Yosuke. One that can never be broken. Except it can be. Your bond with Yosuke has affected his persona. Ooh, what's it gonna be? Oh, there we go! Resist Electric was added to Yosuke's persona skills. Very nice. Oh god, what is this I'm feeling? Yosuke's strong will that allowed him to accept and overcome his weakness has awakened his heart's true power. What's he gonna be now? <laughs> it's Corbin, but with those fucking grill shades! Oh my god! Over- Over fucking- <laughs> oh my god, Yosuke's persona has been reborn. Jiraiya has transfigured into Ultra Kermit! Oh my god. <laughs> oh, Kermit. Ultra Kermit. So, that definitely happened. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. I'm still just gonna get everyone to just give up and go home after you get knocked unconscious in the TV world. <laughs> well, I like that they explained that for being the reason, like, that we all just- it's game over. Oh, man. You know what they say, no man left behind except for you specifically, useless Narukami. <laughs> yeah. People leaving out that last bit is a pet peeve of mine. You know, I should probably give you something as a gift. But I don't have anything on me right now, so... Uh, excuse me. Oh, what's this? Oh, what is this? What is this? Okay, we got an interesting text post here. Uh, can I zoom in for you guys? Okay. I recently found out why my mom would never sleep around me when I was a kid. Like, she'd never let herself take naps or sleep if I was awake, ever. Or if she did, she would lock her bedroom door. So, when I was six, I was asleep in my bed in the middle of the night when I hear a loud bang, like a pot being dropped, and come out to the living room to see my mom standing by the window with just a huge pile of spaghetti all over the sill and a pot on the ground. And I'm like, are you gonna eat all that? And y'all, she gets big mad and yells at me and chases me to my room. But then a little while later, a bunch of cops show up and ask me a bunch of random ass questions about my art. Like, this one cop lady keeps asking me to draw dragons for her, and they seem mad as hell. I didn't want to get arrested, so I just never asked my mom for spaghettis after that. Lesson learned. Don't ask mom for spaghettis, or she'll call the damn police on you. What? So, I have this memory in my head, and it goes unquestioned until I say it out loud for the first time a few months back. And as soon as I say the words, when I was six, my mom called the cops on me for asking for spaghettis. My adult logic slams into place and is like, hang on, your mother definitely did not call the police on a six-year-old for asking for spaghetti. So obviously that's not what really went down. I call up my mom to tell her how I remember it, and on top of her figuring out why her kid has always been really cagey around spaghettis for the last three decades, she tells me what really happened. So on that night, a man tried to break into our house through the front window. It was just my mom and her kids, so she did what she felt she had to and shot him in the head? He'd been wearing a helmet, which landed on the floor under the window. Oh no, I see where this is going. 
Now, I, I just want you all to put yourselves in my mom's shoes for a minute here. This woman has just taken a human life. The trauma of that, the instant agony, the panic, the guilt, the fear, all of it hitting her at once. Her only solace, the knowledge that her children are safe. She protected her daughters. No matter the cost to her soul, her children are safe. Then she looks up and sees her six-year-old staring at the inside of this man's head before saying, Are you going to eat all that? <laughs> Damn, if this is... <laughs> what the... <laughs> oh, the McDonald's. If this is true, holy shit, that is quite the story. God. I like how the fucking kid thinks it's spaghetti, too. I mean, yeah, like blood, tomato sauce, whatever, but holy shit, that was crazy. Wow. Any Anyways, <laughs> let's get back to this story. Ah. Here, have this. Yosuke passes an old used band-aid to you. <laughs> well, I like how they explain- <laughs> Cause like, he does give you the band-aid in the original game too, and it's like, what the fuck? So I like that this is like the explanation for that. Mom's spaghetti. She's nervous. Oh. That's the punchline, huh? Still though, that, that was a very interesting story. Anyways, you spent a long time with Yosuke before heading home. Obtained a new outfit? What did we get? Wait, what did we get? Who has a new outfit? Hold on, we have to see. Did Yosuke get a sexy outfit? Yosuke actually Yosuke? Cosplay as the virtually uh, the virtual pop star waving in waves across Dub Japan. Actually Yosuke. <gasps> I want to wear that. Oh, I want to wear that. Okay, um uh I guess that's for the dungeon. We'll see it next time then. Ooh, okay. Um, well, that's been making me want to read some- or write some fanfiction. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Um, I hope there's no social links to distract me. Because I kind of want to go to whatever's at the bathhouse. Oh, we got a song request. Okay, what's- oh. oh. Okay, fine. I'll hang out with you, Ayane. Clint Eastwood by Gorillaz. Okay! Actually, haven't I done that before? Not that I mind, though. Alright, you know what? We'll do that now. Here. Let me find the instrumental. Okay. Got me the karaoke. Okay. I'm gonna just uh, turn the sound off real quick. Alright. So. Here is Clint Eastwood by Gorillaz. I hope you're ready, Jacob. Oh, here we go. <clears throat> happy i'm feeling glad i got sunshine in a bag i'm useless <laughs> but not for long the future is coming on i ain't happy i'm feeling glad i got sunshine in a bag i'm useless but not for long the future is coming on it's coming on it's coming on it's coming on yeah <laughs> Finally, someone let me out of my cage. Now, time for me is nothing, cause I'm counting no age. Now I couldn't be there. Now you shouldn't be scared. I'm good at repairs, and I'm under each snare. Intangible, bet you didn't think so, I command you to. Panoramic view, look, I'll make it all manageable. Pick and choose, sit and lose, all you different crews. Chicks and dudes, who you think is really kicking tunes. 
picture you getting down in a picture tube. Like you look the fuse. You think it's fictional, mystical, maybe spiritual. Hero who appears in you to clear your view when you're too crazy. Lifeless to those, the definition for what life is. Priceless to you because I put you on the high shit. You like it? Gun smoking righteous with one. Talk your psychic among those possess you with one. Go ain't happy. I'm feeling glad I got sunshine. In a bag, I'm useless, but not for long. The future is coming on. I ain't happy. I'm feeling glad I got sunshine. In a bag, I'm useless, but not for long. The future is coming on. It's coming on. It's coming on. It's coming on. It's coming on. The essence, the basics. Without did you make it? Allow me to make this childlike in nature. Rhythm, you have it or you don't. That's a fallacy. I'm in them. Every sprouting tree, every child of peace, every cloud and sea, you see with your eyes. I see destruction and demise. Corruption in disguise from this fucking enterprise. Now I'm sucked into your lies through Russell, not his muscles, but percussion he provides. For me as a guide, y'all can see me now cause you don't see with your eye, you perceive with your mind, that's the inner. So I'ma stick around with Russ and be a mentor, bust a few rhymes so motherfuckers remember where the thought is. I brought all this so you can survive when law is lawless, feeling sensations that you thought was dead, no squealing, remember that it's all in your head. I ain't happy, I'm feeling glad I got sunshine. In a bag, I'm useless, but not for long. The future is coming on. I ain't happy. I'm feeling glad I got sunshine. In a bag, I'm useless, but not for long. My future is coming on. It's coming on. It's coming on. It's coming on. It's coming on. My future. It's coming on, it's coming on, it's coming on, it's coming on, it's coming on. My future is coming on, it's coming on, it's coming on, it's coming on, it's coming on. My future is coming on, it's coming on, it's coming on. My future is coming on, it's coming on, it's coming on. My future. It's coming on, it's coming on, it's coming on, my future. But yeah, that was Clint Eastwood by Gorillaz, I hope you enjoyed that. Yeah, like, as soon as, as soon as I'm useless came up, I knew, I knew that was why. Like, I, I swear to god we've sung this song on stream before, but, you know what, I'll allow it. Because this should be useless's theme. <laughs> You've been waiting for the past few days for me to do a Persona stream just so you could make the joke? Good. Good. It was worth it. <laughs> but yes. Uh, okay. We, we won't- It goes on for like two more minutes. It's okay. It, there's nothing else after that. It, it, it's fine. But yeah. <laughs> you got your joke, so I'm, I'm glad. Anyways, back to our social link. Okay. Let's see. Sa Samagawa Riverbank. Ayane brought you here after practice again. I think I've finally decided what I need to do. I need to start acting more selfish. In fact, not just selfish. I'll become the biggest asshole in all of Yasugami. I'll be rude to everyone with sick burns. I'll make everyone hate, yet be frightened by my appalling behavior. I'll be so rude and idiotic acting that even you'll start to get jealous of how stupid and assholeish I am. Everyone will be too scared of me to deny or decline anything I say and it'll all be perfect. And I'll be able to speak perfectly to everyone, just like you do. Okay, maybe that's a bit too far. But my point is, I want to stop letting all the flames burn away at my soul. So I'm going to try and stop being so submissive. I want to be able to speak my mind openly like I do with you. I've never done it before because I was always scared of being ridiculed or shunned. So I just always went with what others wanted. But now, I'm gonna burn those fears in the fires of my soul! I'll express who I really am now. I'll voice my opinions. And if it gets on someone- or if it gets me on someone's bad side, then that's that. 
I don't think you helped me realize any of that, but I'm just gonna say you did so you feel good, you creepy stupid man who I keep hanging around because you gave me blood. <laughs> I feel good. Shake, shake. You know, Useless should just have, like, his, like, patron band is just gorillas now. <laughs> you feel good. Yay! Level 8. Uh, hey, um, if it's not too much of a hassle, I think it's about time I get a little bit more blood in me. God damn it. <laughs> God, I just love how she's a vampire for some reason. I don't know if they'll ever explain it, but that's a thing. Alright, we're definitely gonna want to save. Oh my god, look at Yosuke! Wait! Oh! Oh! The outfit was for Yosuke! So he's just Hatsune Miku now! <laughs> okay. Oh! Yeah, Yosuke Miku confirmed! Holy shit! <laughs> but here, I'm, I'll, I'll watch the clip. I'll, I'll watch the clip. I'm useless Narukabi. Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. It was all building up to that. Of it, yes. Uh. God, okay, so hopefully no social links pop up because I want to witness Yosuke Miku in dungeon. Yeah, so Chie and Yosuke are all taken care of. Let's go to the TV world. Ayani again? Really? Uh, okay. Hold on. Let me check something really quick. Oh, there's Yukiko. Oh, okay, fine. We'll hang out with Yukiko. Oh, hello, useless. Do you want to go hang out somewhere? Okay, let's do it. Man, all these social links. Wait! Oh, that wasn't even an event! Ah! Uh, whatever. Alright, let's write some friend fiction to make up for the lack of social link events. Actually... Wait, I want to check out the books again. Hold on. It's Sunday today, so you have the day off school. Cool. Wait, isn't Yukiko available? Okay, before I do that though, I want to see if there's other chapters of these books. Okay, no. Alright, the England to English thing is still the same. Skip, 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 skip. I just wanted to see if there were extra chapters. So, let's see if there's- Oh! No, it's only chapter 1. Okay, so we're just- we're just writing chapter 2, I'm assuming. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I just wanted to see that. Let's see. You know what? No, we should go to the TV world. Let's be good. Let's be good and go to the TV world, get some training in, and check out whatever the hell is near the bathhouse. Oh, hey, Hermit, what's up? Oh my god, look, it's... It's Yosuke Miku! Jesus fucking Christ, why do I agree to these things? I paid for a goddamn wig to do this! You're a slave to useless will, Yosuke. We all are when we're in this world. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> Alright, let's take a look at the bathhouse. Oh my god, every time Kanji's gonna bring up this conversation. We just wanna go to the bathhouse. What? Seriously? Damn it. Oh wait, he said seriously, hold on. <laughs> I, I need the thing. Every time seriously pops up. Seriously? Again. Seriously? <laughs> 
<laughs> okay. I'm pleased. All right. What could it be? What could it be? What could be awaiting us? Oh, so no secret. Oh, I was expecting a secret passageway or something. I think it's just a regular, like, shadow thing then. Okay, well, it's okay. Let's see if we can beat it. Or, okay. Nah, it's okay. I could sense something really big behind this door! Are you sure you're ready to enter? Yes. Let's try it. Let's give it a shot. Come on, let's go all out! Tamed towel? Wait, is this the same fucking towel from before? Okay, so uh, let's try a Zio. God, deep breath. Uh, this. Let's do Skull Slammer. And. Oh, right, we're Kanji now. Do Fatal End? You for. What? Oh! Oh, okay! Yeah! Yeah, we have seen that towel before. Or maybe it's a different one. But Yosuke is- yeah. Like, the towel was supposed to be the mid-boss for this dungeon. And it, it ended the same way. Like, you just hit it and that's it. Oh! Oh hey Charlie, what's up? Um, I heard the hoop, But I don't think you guys did? But I'll say it again, uh, just to redeem that. Whoop! But yeah, I, I haven't worked on it, so it, it's still gonna be pretty quiet. Yeah, the tea towel. <laughs> God damn it, another towel. What a rip. Was that it? Oh, you heard the who? Oh, good, okay. Good, I'm glad. Was that really it? Sick. Wh what? That was it? You- you can't be- Seriously?! What the fuck? <laughs> Damn, and Teddy was all like, Oh, there's something there! Not even a s secret dungeon, just- Yeah, that's it. Alright, we're going back to Risei's dungeon. Time to go back to the strip club. Yosuke, why aren't you wearing the outfit? No, he'll wear it here. Alright. Let us continue to go through this dungeon. See what we can find. Where are those stairs? Oh, hey, a chest. Time to get some strippers. Yeah, baby. Check out those chests. Glow sticks? Whoa, wait. What do those do? Oh, are those for Yosuke? User earns extra experience. Uh, okay. What does that do for his strength, though? Let me see. Oh! Oh, he's stronger! Yeah, get those glow sticks, Yosuke! Hell yeah! <laughs> oh my god, fucking glow sticks. Honestly, I can see them work as, like, an actual weapon for him in the actual game. Man. Yosuke shuffles out, then shuffles back in wearing Miku outfit. <laughs> oh wait, oh, oh, I'm sorry. I, I didn't see the first one. And why aren't you in uniform? Yosuke shuffles out, then shuffles back in, wearing Miku outfit. Warning, Yosuke might not level up at the same time as you- <gasps> Oh no. Oh no. I'll try it first. Crinkled bills? Oh, you're gonna head out early, Wolf? Oh, it's okay. Yeah, like, you had a busy day today, so I wouldn't blame you for being drained. But yeah. I hope you rest up nice and easy. Have a good night's rest. And we'll catch you next time. But yeah, have a good one. And thanks for dropping by. I appreciate it. Always fun talking you. Or talking with you. But 
Crumpled bills? Who's that for? Hold on. Fan of- Fan of crinkled bills! Ew! <laughs> I'll give it to Yukiko. Here. You may leave early? Oh, okay. Well, what whatever you decide to do, I am in full support. Oh, you might you might fall asleep during the stream. Yeah, we'll, we'll see. It's all right if you do, because again, you had a long day. You had a long day, so you know, do whatever you're comfortable with. If you would like me as background noise, I'm always glad to be. Okay. Um. Yeah, I'll do Mazio. And then Magaru's good. You're going to do Rampage, I guess? And then you can do, a uh... Gale Slash. Oh, that's a lot of HP. That's okay. Damn, Kanji's eyes look, like, very menacing in that portrait. What a positive way of looking at it. Yeah! Think positive! It's good to be positive. Tabasco! Yeah! We're fighting cold Tabasco. Yeah, bottles of Tabasco. And they're cold, so they're, they use ice this time. <laughs> Alright. You do that, you just hit. Oh, uh, nah, you just hit. Okay. What? How are you- How was she still- Or it's still alive. Okay. Oh, alright, we still leveled up at the same time. That's good. You think the fighting portraits are the arena portraits? Oh, wait, yeah. Yes, I heard about Arena. I'm extremely excited. Like, oh my god, I can finally play um, Ultimax on the Ghostge. Like, I think I'll get the Switch version because um, I won't have to like use remote desktop from work and I'll be able to like just, you know, just play it on the go. So I'd look forward to that. Like, I definitely want like a physical copy. So. There's that. Tabasco can be a lady. That's true. That's true. You're right. You're so pumped to beat up Teddy on the go, right? Me too. But yeah, I'm excited. More people can know about Labrys and Sho Minazuki. Sho and Minazuki. But yeah, it's gonna be great. Ooh, a gold chest. Gust pin. Uh, I think I've already had those. Or maybe not. Yosuke? Um, let's see. Oh, that's resistance. Never mind. Why is there a sign on the wall that just says sexual? Oh, so when... When Risei was, like, on the Midnight Channel, she was all like, Oh, I hope you're ready for sexy, sexy sex time! And, like, uh, that's totally sexual or whatever. And, like, Yosuke, like, when the dungeon was all dark and everything, like, before the lights came on, he was all like, oh, this place totally won't be sexual or anything. And then it was funny, because, like, that fucking sign that just says sexual just, like, shows up. It was great. Oh. Oh, super happy. The trickery? No! It was a mimic! Course calculator. Okay. Um, oh shit, okay. Uh, Yosuke should probably use Diorama on himself. I'm gonna do Mabufu and. Just in case, do a Gale Slash. Oh fuck, maybe I should have healed him. Oh, okay, good thing I didn't do Mazio then. Fuck. You've always wanted to write about Labyrinth and show, but could never because you haven't played the game. Oh, okay. Playthroughs, alright. But you retain information better if you play the game. Yeah! Yeah, exactly. Like, I think, like, if you experience it yourself, like, yeah, it should- You'll have 
more unique memories, like, you know, to yourself as opposed to watching someone. But nothing wrong with playthroughs either. But yeah, um, let's do Fatal End. But yeah, like, this is your chance. You can finally get it. And I'm glad that they're, like, releasing it on, like, multiple, um, multiple, uh, platforms too, like, including Steam, so that's good. Very nice. Oh, uh, you know what? You just hit. Oh, you know what? Maybe I should have had useless, like, use Diorama on Kanji. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, don't I have... But yeah, calculators in a strip club? You gotta manage those bills. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you gotta make it rain. Reasonably. Um, okay, so you're gonna do Diorama here. Wait, do we have stuff that... You know what? Nah. No, if I stat... Oh, not stat penalties. Never mind. Makaru, Mabufu. Yikes. Okay, um... Let's see. I'll have you do Fatal End to this one. You're gonna do Magaru again. Oh, right, you're silenced. Okay. You know what? I want to guard, and then you're going to, uh... Kill Rush. Kill Rush this one. Oh no, Kanji. Okay. Do Fatal End on this one. Magaru. Hit. Hit. <laughs> what? What happened? Why are you still alive? There we go. Yeah, there we go. More crinkled bills. Wait. We're so we have like two of those now? Huh. Okay. Well, I could sell those. <laughs> oh, wait, that- Ah. Oh. Dead end. Okay. Let's see, where have we not gone? That goes downstairs. Um... Have we been up here? Okay. Oh, no. Nah. Oh, wait. Okay, we can still get that chest, and there's another one there. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna assume that one's a surprise attack, so we'll leave that one alone. Cool, cool. Hmm. Where could those stairs be? One huge strip club. Oh, we got a key. Okay. Dead end. Go back over there. Baby, baby. Okay. Let's see. Mazio. Magaru. Mmm. Rampage. Mazio. Nice! Ooh. Alright. Um, let's see. Use, uh, Diorama. Okay. 
on yourself. You're going to do Magaru. Hit this one, hit that one. Oh, nice, Yosuke! Okay. Mm. Ooh, new chest. Please be a super- Yeah! Super fun, happy chest! Love to see it. Okay. All right, we got some perfect lightning enemies, or er, enemies to use lightning on. You just hit the cold sauce, Mazio. Nice. Not nice. Uh oh. That's okay. Alright. Um, you know what? I think you guys can just hit. Use a Magaru though. Here. There we go. Uh, okay, so back up here. Oh, I did not see that shadow. Ah, perfect. Perfect for my lightning boys. Actually, I'll just have Yosuke attack and Chie. You two will take care of the magics. Oh wait, that's right, they're immune to physical attacks! Fuck, I forgot. Well, at least they don't absorb those. Okay. And they're knocked down too, so we're Gucci. Excuse me. Oh yeah, so how much- how many more, uh... Oh, that does make him stronger, though. You know, it's fine. It's fine. Yosuke can be ahead of us, that's fine. I just really like that strong attack and magic for him. I want Yosuke to be strong. Ah, perfect for a windy boy. Okay, yeah, I'll go with that. Yo, it's me, Yusuke <laughs> Onomura for Persona 4 on the Nintendo Switch! Blank body pillow, what the fuck? Is that for Kanji? But anyways, thank you, Experimenter, as always, for hosting my stream. Appreciate it. Oh my god, it is for Kanji. A love pillow minus the thing to love. User regains 5% of their HP each turn. Ugh. <laughs> Damn. Makes me really want that Yosuke body pillow more and more. But god... I can't believe Kanji has a fucking body pillow <laughs> to attack with. Uh. All right. Mazio, Magaru, Mabufu, Mazio. Look at them all knocked down like that. Okay, cool. Okay. Uh, 
I have a feeling... Oh, what? Those are downstairs! Have I been up here yet? Oh, where are the stairs that go up? Alright. Rampage. Mazio. Nice. Ooh, two crits. Nice. Nice. Damn, that rampage went on for a bit. Okay. Everyone just, like, sick air attacks on them. Oh, okay, perfect. Wait, have we been here before? I don't remember. Hmm. But yeah, I have a feeling those Risei posters or whatever are actually body pillows. So, where are the Risei body pillows we can attack with? <laughs> where are those stairs? Well, at least we're getting some good training in. They look like body pillows to you. Yeah, that's what I was thinking the first time. And like, you know, it's a strip club, so you think. Damn, Yosuke just climbing up. Uh, I don't know where I turned or not. Okay. Yep, just magic. Yeehaw! Mm. Alright. Oh, oh, I don't remember! Actually, wait, we- mm. Yeah. Where are those fucking stairs? Wait, no, Mabufu. No, you stop. Um, let's do Skull Slammer this time. Maybe, or, yeah, do it on this one, and you can do. Um, do Fatal End on this one. attack, no problem. Oh, yikes, Kanji! Gotta heal him. I'm just grateful that even, like, party members who aren't, like, in the party, like, like, actually there, still get experience. Ugh, it's always useful. Um, yeah, so you get- oh, that doesn't do much. Um, the lifestone, right? Let's get that to you. Okay. Go back. I don't remember where I didn't turn. Mm. Mm. Maybe over here? Mm. Oh, there's the stairs. Okay, cool. Oh, we've reached the mid-boss? I sense that Risei girl behind her. Here. Are you ready to enter? Let me double check. On. Um, I mean... Maybe I should use a snuff soul. On you... And Kanji. Okay. Alright. Now I'm good. It's Risei, but something's different. Yosuke, we all realize it's your other self. Hello, all you fans! Thanks for coming in today! Today you're gonna see every last inch of me. 
How much I gotta fork up? <laughs> Damn, Kanji, okay. Kanji, keep your head in the game. Shadows don't know about money. They aren't gonna charge us unless we bring it up to them. Oh, uh, alright, sorry. Huh? You don't believe me? Were you listening? I said I want to see some tits! <laughs> Kanji! Hey, I ain't gonna force her to strip, but she's already- Shut up! Then why don't we? Aw, but this is only the fifth floor! That wouldn't make for a very exciting journey. You have to earn your right to see tits. Just follow me a bit further in and I'll prove I'm honest about every last one of my words. Yeah, Kanji way horny in. <laughs> Sheesh! The roar of the crowd is insane this time. It's making me feel sick. If people really are watching this, then we gotta do something fast or else her mountains will be everywhere. <laughs> All right, Risa Tears, don't touch that dial. When we get back, you'll get a big, long look at the real me. Okay. Hmm. When was the last time I saw a TV with a dial to switch channels? This is a thousand times worse than a few nasty secrets and seeing Kanji's ass. What's so bad about my ass? What we just saw was that Risa- Wait. What we just saw was what that Risa girl is suppressing. We're gonna have to save her before she ends up showing off her bear behind! Let's go! Alright. Well, okay, you know what? I needed to heal some SP anyways. That's fine, so we can keep going. Okay, I'm gonna guess the one on the right isn't the Mimic. Sweet. All right, let's get that other chest over here. Oh, we don't have a key. Damn. Oh, there's the stairs already. All right. Perfect. How do I know one is a mimic? Um, usually if there's like two chests, you have to choose which one's which. So I'm just guessing. But yeah, like, cause like, that one time that happened where we opened a chest and it was like, oh! Like, I'm just assuming it's a mimic. I don't- I don't want to, like, risk it. If I see two chests together, I'm gonna assume one of them is a fake. And I did not see that chest there. Or, shadow. Careless key! Okay, that's new. Alright, everyone, let's test this out. Wait! Wait, Mazio's not good, but we can try Zio on this key. Magaru, Mabufu, you use Zionga on this key. Oh, okay, so maybe they're weak against ice since they're using fire. Or not. Okay. Let's do another Magaru. Another Mabufu. Um. I'll have you do Gale Slash. Oh, Diorama! Really? Ugh, well at least that key's gone. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay, um... Oh, Useless is confused. Uh, I think we're okay. Actually... Now I'll have you use Magaru. Excuse me. And then you can hit this one. And hit, um... You love and hate this game from what you've seen. <laughs> yeah, like... There's a lot... <laughs> there's a lot of bastardization going on, but it's hilarious. But hey, Matthew, what's up? It's just a very entertaining game. You know people like this battle theme, but as a battle theme, you're like, Make it stop, please. Oh, Lone Prayer? Yeah, like, I don't know, like, I like the song. But I can only imagine, like, hearing that over and over again when you're actually playing, like, Persona 1. Like, I'd rather hear the original battle theme from, Re um, you know, the first Persona 1, um, than that song. Oh, right, we can't open chests because of the Reaper. I'm not gonna risk it.
as a song it's good but all you hear is living buried memory over and over and over right oh <laughs> there it is again yeah i'm just glad that the battle themes switch up in this game it's really cool um you know what why don't we have you do fatal end on this key And then you do, uh, let's have you do Fatal End on that one. Oh, I should heal Yosuke. You feel proud. You finished a 32-minute script recording for a video you're hoping to get out by Christmas. Oh, damn, congrats. But yeah, hope that video turns out well. It's been a while since you've made a video, but it's fun. But time-consuming. Yeah, like, it definitely takes a lot of time with all the editing and everything, making sure you get the recordings right. And writing scripts, too, like, that... It, it takes time. But as long as you're having fun with it, that that's cool. Um... Nah, I should heal Yosuke. And you're gonna use Makaru. But yeah, what's the video on? Or is it a surprise? Oh, she silenced. Um... Okay, you do, uh, fatal end on the calculator. Ugh, yeah, I need to get rid of those keys. Yeah, okay. Ah. Okay. It's for a game you streamed a month ago being a Japan-only Nintendo game called Marvelous Another Treasure Island. Oh, interesting! Okay, well, cool. Uh, I'm gonna have you do Kill Rush on this guy. Mm, maybe... See what happens if you do- No, actually, I want you to do Garula. It was a Zelda clone directed by the guy who would go on to direct all the Zelda games after Ocarina of Time. Really? That's interesting. Huh. Oh! But yeah, how was that game? Um. Oh, you can't do Zeo. Um, you know what? I'll just have you attack. You can do another Garula, that's fine. Uh, you can only attack, and I'll just have you attack too. It was really fun, but rough in a few places. Mmm, I can imagine, because like... If it was like, did you say it was like a SNES, a NES game? Or it sounds old. Oh, we got Mazionga, cool. Oh, it was Super Nintendo. Okay, that's cool. But yeah, like limited, like um, I don't know, like you have limits to what you can do on the SNES, so I can imagine. But at least you had fun with it. Oh. These guys rushing at us. Oh man, we haven't heard wiping all out like this whole stream. Oh, and those are new scissors. Or er, new opponents. Okay, try uh... Try Zionga on the slicers. It was good. Just had some annoying moments you bring up in your video. Oh, okay. You also make sure to bring up its more creative elements. Of course, yeah. Hit on the pros and cons, of course. Um... Yeah, do that. It has so many cool moments. Ooh! Well, that's cool then. Yeah, you know what? I, I'd have to check it out. Is it gonna go up on your YouTube? Okay, cool. Actually, wait, shit. Come to think of it, I don't think I'm subscribed to you on there yet. I'm gonna go, like, check that out. I'm interested. Um, let's do... You know what? Just attack the slicers, and you're gonna do Magaru. Oh, you got a link to your channel! Alright, awesome! Thank you for that! If you wanna go ahead and check out that video, go ahead and like give him a follow, or, ch or just check it out. Yeah. Like, I haven't heard of this game, so that sounds cool. Here, I'll go ahead and follow right now, then. Subscribe. Oh, is that your dog? That's cute! Yeah, no problem, I got you. I'm always out to support my followers. It's your dog? It's a cute dog. 
I should heal Kanji. M maybe outside of battle, I think we'll be okay. Yeah, see? There we go. Thanks, Yosuke. Ooh, he's got Magarula now. Okay. How close is useless to leveling? Oh, damn. They weren't kidding when Yosuke would get a lot of XP. But it's okay. Be strong for us, Yosuke. Um, okay. I'm going to use a lifestone for Kanji. Perfect. I need to find those stairs! The rattling is making me unsettled. Uh, hmm. Oh, no, those are downstairs. Mm. Have we gone left? <laughs> I just can't believe they have slam- They have space jam fucking- Mash up to reach out to the truth. That makes things more interesting, but yeah. Yeah, we got Space Jam up in here. Um. Uh. Oh, yeah, let's test out Mazionga. Magaru would be good. Wait, you have Magarula! Let's do that. Um. Was Mabufu good? Fuck it. Here you go. Yikes. Let me get those stats down. Whoa, look at that. Whoa! Come on, get rid of this guy. I'm glad it didn't use Diorama on itself. Heat wave, cool! Look at that. Wait, no, don't open the chest. Do not be tempted. The Reaper will come out. Stairs, stairs, where are you? <laughs> I just want the stairs. Wait, I feel like that's one of the main corridors we've been down. Let's try going here. We haven't been here. Alright. Mazionga, Makarula, uh, Mabufu, sure. Let's do Heat Wave. I want to see. Wait, doesn't- isn't Chie supposed to know Heat Wave too? Let me check on our moveset again. Am I- Oh yeah, I am excited for the P4 Ultimax release. You're indifferent? Yeah, like, see, I'm excited that I'll have the option to, like, play it on the go. On the Gosuke. Cause, like, I usually, like, play it remotely, um, cause I- I pirated it. But I, I play it remotely at work, if I ever feel like fighting with Yosuke. So, if I can like, have it on my Switch, that would be like, very good for me. So like, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Doesn't the original P4 Arena have its own original story before Ultimax? Yes it does! Um, here's the thing, I hear that the, um, this re-release should come with DLC, maybe? That's what I heard. But the DLC would include the arena story, which, I mean, you sh they should have arena included anyways, because, like, Labrys is going to be there and people are going to be like, who the fuck is this? So, you know, it's good that they got- oh wait, oh no, Kanji's okay. Feels weird they didn't bundle it, yeah, but we'll see. I- I don't know, I heard someone say something about, um arena being included, like the original arena, because it would make sense. You need, like, only going into Ultimax without knowing the context of, um, you know, the original arena, like, you're gonna be a little confused. Like, why are there Persona 3 characters here? You know? But yeah, I'm definitely gonna buy a physical copy um, on my Switch. Because I want to support and also have it on the go. That'd be like the best. You've heard rumors of P3 Portable getting remastered too. Oh fuck. Do I have a key? Okay. Yeah, like, I've heard rumors of like, at least like something Persona 3 related. I'm hoping the rumors are true. 
But yeah, take it with a grain of salt. Yeah, it's just rumored. Like, I want it to be official, because, like, I've never played Persona 3, so I want... Like, I'm, like, putting off any, like, main Persona games, except for 5, because, like, I... You know, it's it's not like they need to remaster it or anything, because it's, like, right there on, like, latest consoles, whatever. But, um... Stolen Globe? Oh, that's new. Okay. But, yeah, like... Before I, like, try, like, Persona 2 or 3, like, you know, if I need to pirate it, I'm, like, putting that off. So that... Just in case Atlas does port them and remaster or whatever. I want to know how they work. And, like, yeah, I just want to see your official release. Oh. Okay, wind's not good. You prefer FES to portable personally, but it's down to taste. Yeah, that's true. Like, ideally it would be cool if they mixed elements of both. Cause like... I do want to like, see Femsi's route. I'm curious. But, um... Other than that, like... I don't know, just as long as we get Persona 3. Like, any form of it. I would, like, be glad. Okay, I gotta give this lifestyle to Kanji. Um, I think we're okay. Yeah. Where are those stairs? That's downstairs. Uh huh. Where have I not gone? Have I gone here yet? P3 was one of your first Atlas games, so it's really nostalgic to you. Oh, nice! Yeah, so it'd be cool. It'd be cool if we did get to see, like, you know, a remaster for it. After you finished P5. Ooh, okay. Oh, there's... Um, hold on. I think I should... <laughs> Here, I'll, I'll give some more Snuff Souls. Useless. Uh... Okay, we'll see how we do with this much SP. Like, Kanji and Chie can be fine with physicals, but, yeah. Let, let's just see how this goes. Oh, wow! You've come all this way just to see me? You must be huge fans! You must really want to get a peek at me. Well, since you've tried so hard and come so far... In the end, it doesn't even matter! I should do something special for you! But not here. You've got to prove your love a little bit more. And what better way to do that than to show it on the battlefield? Wait, this song sounds vaguely familiar. I've tried so hard and come so far. <laughs> Whoa, that's a lot of shadows. Come on, everyone. It's showtime! What is this song? Stained Pole. Oh my god, okay. Well, let's try Mazionga, Magarula, Mabufu, and Heatwave. You think that's the Shadow the Hedgehog theme from Sonic Adventure 2 before the battle started? Oh, damn, okay! <laughs> damn, alright! Shadow the Hedgehog, sure! Oh, cause, cause Shadow- okay. That's fitting. <laughs> alright, not bad. You know what? Everyone just attack. Ha ha ha! Shadow funny! Ha ha! There we go. Fucking bro- oh, No! No! Are you fucking serious? I got too cocky! Uh, Persono. Exclusive mattress fact of the day. Persono is also the name of a mattress company. Is it? Wait, is it really? Let me see. Persona mattress, let me see. It's in Lebanon? Oh, well, okay, it is. Oh, no, it says Persona. Wait, I I put Persona. No, 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 no. I Persona mattress. PT, where's that? Oh, it is real! That's what they're using! 
Damn, okay, time to get a Persona mattress. Ah, useless rest in peace. What is this sound font? It's those bike horns. <laughs> I just love the different game over screens. Wait, so that means... Oh no. Oh no. But, uh, Yosuke still has his sexy... Yeah, okay, He's he still has the Miku outfit. I'm discouraged now. I'm discouraged now. Fuck. And I need to eat. I need to have dinner. <laughs> okay, well, you know what? Well, wait. Does that mean? Does that mean that the fucking towel fight from the bathhouse, like, didn't save? Oh my god, this is why you have to constantly save. I got cocky. Alright, well, next time we'll go back. Try and get to that part of Risei's dungeon again. Hopefully not get lost. Uh. You don't know whether you should be impressed or hate the fact someone remade Persona 4 in Game Maker as satire. It It's definitely impressive, I'm giving them that. Oh, you know what? There's also a sequel. But, like, they did Persona 3. It's called Persona Zero. So that exists. I'm just not gonna touch it because I haven't played Persona 3 yet. So like, once I play it, you know, once I actually like get the Persona 3 experience, I will check it out. But yeah. Did the towel fight even give any reward worth going back for? Uh, oh, that's true. Like it only gave us two experience points. If anything, I don't remember how much money. Okay, I'll go back in the VOD and check to see how much money. Otherwise, like it wouldn't be worth it. I mean, it doesn't matter anyways, because it's like, I don't have to use, like, SP or whatever. So I can, like, go back, hit it even just for a little bit of, um, you know, experience, and then just, uh, call it, or, you know, just, uh, what is it? Go back to Risei's dungeon from there. Like, I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind. It's, it's funny fighting the towel. But yeah. Yeah, fair. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like, I, I like this person's humor. Like, whoever made this game, they're- <laughs> They capture, um, the Persona 4's main story and the social links perfectly, but also, like, adding that humorous flavor. <laughs> I just- I, I can't wait to see what the Persona 3 one is like after I, I actually experience the game myself. Because, like, this person knows how to entertain. But yeah. Ooh, Chuck's gonna have KFC! Nice! I'm having chicken too, but it's homemade. So, yeah. But yeah, I'm gonna have that chicken right now. I am hungies. But anyways, thank you for tuning into the stream. As always, I appreciate having you guys on the stream, and talking with you is always fun. Always glad to see my peeps. And um, if you're just watching, then I'm always glad to be entertainment. Yeah, no problem. I always got you. Always glad to stream for y'all. Um, okay. So, tomorrow, I think... Yeah, I haven't been able to grind in DMC4. Unless I find time to do that tonight, then um, I'm probably gonna stream, like, All-Star Battle tomorrow. So, yeah. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Just, just check out. Be on the lookout. Keep your eyes peeled. But yeah... Mata Nene, my dudes, I hope you have a lovely rest of your night or day, wherever you may be. Yeah, I'll catch you later. Damn. Aw, oh, experimenter, damn. I don't know if you just, like, popped in or what, but again, thank you for the stream. Or, the host. Thank you for hosting my stream. Damn. Rip, though. <laughs> but yes. See y'all later. Have a good one. And peace.